Good morning, Brian. I'm going to uh, try my best to try and compress. I found a, an app on iPhone that um, is supposed to compress videos for stuff just like this. But Here's your flute. Um, I did the walnut end with the mouthpiece like we had talked about. Fits very well. It's got a slight little bevel to it so that it holds up on your lip a little easier. And this is my wave block. And I use a piece of, if you can see the little piece of yellow, it's Osage orange that I put underneath. That helps for whenever it gets any moisture in it. Uh, it doesn't fur the grain up and cause it to get fuzzy as time goes on. And um, I tight finger spacing. You can see my finger is probably about an inch, and that's what I, um, you know, show people or whatever. But it's uh, they're about an inch and three sixteenths in between, so it makes it very easy to play. And uh, I did the the end on it, like we had talked about. This is a walnut end. But a very beautiful flute. I'm very impressed with this one. But uh, I'll play a little bit and then um, and send this to you and see what you think. Now granted, if you're, uh, if you're using a tuner, I always tell people that it's about 50 degrees, so I'm about 20 degrees, 22 degrees away from what optimal tuning is. So the, if you're pulling a tuner up, the tuner is going to show it being probably about 30 cents flat. And uh, all the notes are in tune to each other. Um, I use a uh, orchestral tuner, and um, it, if there was some way I could hold it here, I'd show you. But um, like uh, just this third note. So you can see they're all within probably two to three cents of each other and um, just depending on how much pressure and stuff you blow but um, uh, it's finely tuned I use a uh, an oil based finish uh, it's called BioShield um, John Norris Ed Daughtery Tree Life Design several other makers use it and they're the ones that turned me on to it but it's an all natural uh, finish and um, and then I use a top coat of uh, tea tree oil beeswax and um, coconut oil and lavender and it makes it smell good and also it um, it helps condition the flute on the top coat um, but it, other than that it's a completely water resistant um, I finished the inside and out uh, a lot of hand work um, taken into these uh, flutes that I make so um, I hope you're impressed and I hope you like it and I will look forward to hearing back from you and you have a blessed day talk to you later bye Brian